would you rather perpetuate biases or have robots controlling humans? Hi, I'm Dr. Mandy Meiskins, and both of these answers suck, but we have to pick one. So as you know, AI models are trained on human behavior. So where there's human bias, the AI is going to continue to, to perpetuate that bias. Think, especially the AIs lately have been trained a lot on the internet, where it can be like an absolute cesspool sometimes. Now you're totally cool, we're cool, but the, the biases are real, whether it's racism, gender bias, uh, ableism, all these terrible biases are baked into the training data and are going to perpetually be uh, continuously repeated by the AI in perpetuity, unless we change something. And so that brings us to the other side of the argument, which is that we might decide to have these AIs specifically designed to correct human behavior, correct our mistakes and make things fairer and the world, which leads to this slippery slope of where AI will be telling humans what to do and correcting human behavior. Like 90% of people I've told about this think that that is so icky. <laughs> Um, because that's how sci-fi movies start. And I, I agree, it is icky if you are implementing it incorrectly. But honestly, I think it's something that we need to think about when we're putting these uh, models in these places where people can get hurt, where their livelihoods can get hurt. We need to be very, very careful and conscious and know that humans have been biased in the past. So the AIs without intervention will continue to perpetuate that bias. So what do you think? Ready to jump on board with eight robots telling us what to do? <laughs>